Straight before I came here, I was at Harra High School for quite a number of years. Just prior to that, I had been in the primary service and I had a soul charge school at a place called Ararata near, uh, near Harra. Prior to that, I was at a, a distant place called Waitonga after coming back from the war. Ah. I was getting a very raw deal from the local inspector. Oh, I was highly popular in the district, but he was not giving me the grading marks. And how and Otaki was the one where I struck gold with the <laughs> with the board of governors, and they appointed me. Oh. At that stage when I came, we didn't have the assembly hall. We didn't have a number of other things. I always treasure. We read about the benefits that some schools were having from having a gymnasium. And I managed to get uh, the town behind me on that. We had a Queen Carnival raised the funds built the gymnasium. Mrs. Hillis was a member of the board. He donated the funds for the pool. The longer time goes on, the more these possibilities open up for children, for young people. Well, Jack was a family name. John was the official formal male. Uh, Peter, it's quite a story from my primary school days in Lower Hutt. 